the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters, some differences in height and reach as well. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 207 pounds. The problem. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, four losses. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Busan, South Korea, the Korean Superboy, Do Ho Choi. All right, commit to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready? Ready? Well, there can be few better backdrops for a mixed martial arts live event than this Madison Square Garden, the world's most famous arena. And you remember when we finally got here in 2016, we've been showing up strong ever since. You know, every time you go to MSG, you should come with a big event. This is a phenomenal arena. This is a fantastic fight environment. New York City, baby, the city of dreams. All right, here we go, early round one. We talk about wrestling being a great equalizer in MMA, but length and reach is another one. He's got a great jab. We'll see if he can employ it. You have got to be born with it, right? You don't get taller. When you're a tall guy, you have to understand, make your skill set match your physical abilities. And this guy has done this tremendously. Connects with a right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. And he landed the right hand there. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Right hand punch to the clinch. He changes the angle. Oh, huge right hand! Oh, nice job to defend the takedown and scramble to his feet. Oh, man, head kick lands. Oh, that's a nice strike. <laughs> nice double leg takedown attempt there, and you gotta think that's something that's gonna give him confidence moving forward in this fight. A lot of confidence when it happens that easily. He took a shot, he got a takedown. What now will stop him from doing it over and over? All right, operating inside the closed guard now. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Powerful leg kick lands. Single collar tie now. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Choi shot is blocked. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing, overwhelming him with different attacks. Oh, nice 
Nice punch there by the Korean Super Bowl. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Just a slip there. Oh, single collar tie here. That was lightning fast, that right in. All right, he gets the takedown now, DC. We'll see what he can do in this advantageous spot. He set it up beautifully. Let's see if he can now take full advantage of it. Big ball to punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Back and forth we go here. Slips to avoid the right. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Punch coming, it's blocked. Good punch lands. Liver kick. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Big leg kick land. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. All right, single collar tie now. And they separate. Big kick. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Straight right, he misses. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed, great punch landed to put his opponent down. Take a deep breath for him. All right, get him some water. Slow that heart rate down. All right, here we go. You are absolutely winning this round. You ready? You ready? All right, round two. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Countering with the jab here, but he saw it coming a mile away. Nice job there to block it by Choi. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Big kick land. Slips the punch. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Nice punch by the Korean Super Bowl. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Big knee to the body. Oh, straight right. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Lands flush with that right hand. 
much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well that he drops a big right hand after it. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he wants to try and chase down that big. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. Oh, got it. Good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy, and not just busy, but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off of you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing a fantastic job. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. All right, two minutes now to go in the round. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All right, he's got side control here, DC. You know, he's got a lot of different submissions in his arsenal once this fight gets to the ground. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head, like, through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. to go in round two. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by the Korean Super Bowl. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Choi's hook to the body was blocked. Right idea, wrong execution. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Look at the commitment to kick in this fight. Choi gets in the clinch. Shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it for going in the fight. Blocks the shot. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. If your opponent has you in the clinch, Pulling down on your head, landing punch after punch. You have got to clear that collar tie, reach back inside, and try to find space. Nice punch lands over the top. Punch is blocked. Ten seconds remain in round two. That is a thudding leg kick. Time, time, time. Go, 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 go. Great work last round. You knocked him down. You shown you have the power to put anybody away. This round. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. Most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, collar tie. He's got him in the clinch once again. Ooh, blocks the shot. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Collar tie there. All right, so the fighters are in the clinch again, DC. I get tired just watching these situations. It's exhausting. This is a position where you are constantly draining that gas tank of your opponent. All right, she in the single collar tie. Nice strike. 
And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Just misses with the straight right. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Beautiful kick. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now, as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are gonna count. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Straight right hand, no good. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just misses with a left hook there. Choi's hook shot there looked pretty good, but blocked by the defense. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Continues to mix it up. Oh! Huge right hand! Beautiful diving strike play. There it is! Oh. Yo! Whoa! That was nasty! <laughs> Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Chris Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliante has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, five seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Superboy, Du Ho Chai. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so.